Hello everybody and welcome back to Watch Dogs 2. Um, the last time we left off, we did a whole bunch of stuff. We did a couple of side ops. We uh, we did a couple. Uh, we did a main operation where we went to the Noodle Campus and everything. And then we started a new uh, operation. We started um, Operation Hacker War. Um, we also got the DLC operation uh, Automata, the side operation 911, as well as the side operation Moscow Gambit. Um, so we are going to be finishing up uh, the Hacker War. Um, we're going to be finishing up the Hacker War uh, operation today, and then we're going to do the 911 side op, and then we're going to start these two DLC ops. Um, I think we're going to do those. I've never done those ops before. I've never played them. Um, I did when it when it came to playing um, like the uh, when it came to playing like uh, a lot of the operations from the original game. I played all like the side operative stuff, but. Uh, I never, like, owned the DLC, so, um, so yeah, we're, uh, oh, that's pretty cool looking, um, we're gonna be able to do the DLC for the first time. Alright, so, let me see here where this is, uh, this is all the way over here, so, instead of driving, I think we'll just fast travel to the HQ here. We'll finish the Hacker War um, main op, and then we'll do like the side ops uh, as well. We'll start with 911, and then we'll go into the DLC ones. Like I said, I've never done the DLC ops before, um, so I don't know what they entail. right down the street, right? So I think we can just, I guess we'll just take this sippy bus, eh? This is just right down the street. No need to call a car. So yeah, we've been going to war with Prime 8, um, because fucking Bloom paid them to. You sure you want to keep going with this? I hate fucks. And you know why? The propaganda vids, the graffiti, the anti-whatever do-gooder bullshit. You assholes take yourself so fucking seriously. Oh, you coming at us, but you need to understand. We are all in this together. We can all- Yay! What kind of fucking noob do you think I am? <laughs> what kind of shit stain are you for getting caught? I just thought it was worth a hey. shot. <laughs> See how far you get with dead servers, loser. Got her anyway. We got a ping on the Prime 8 bunker. And Lenny is clueless about it. Maybe. Come on, you guys give her too much credit. Alright, so we're gonna head to the Prime 8 bunker. Well, 
that's far as fuck away. Maybe I will actually call Lance, a car in for that. Important question time. Aliens versus Predator. The question doesn't make any sense. I mean, aliens basically use predators as an external womb to perpetuate their species. And the predators, well, they come from a world where you hunt or you die. They need xenomorphs to hone them into elite warriors. It's a fucked up ecosystem that doesn't really have a winner. Okay, ignoring the science behind it, purely hypothetical. One on one. Away, people. Wins. Are we talking Ridley Scott or Cameron? I like the sequel better. Let's go with them. Marcus, that's a bold statement. We need to have that conversation later. But versus a Cameron alien? They're more aggressive, so the Predator wins. Easily. He's way ahead on a technological level, so he's gonna stand his ground when the Xeno rushes him. But that's like asking who wins between one man and one zombie. The aliens hunt in packs. Okay, okay. How many aliens would make it a fair fight with one Predator? Five. Well, three. I could see a Predator Spearmaster keeping two away with a Yaucha combo stick, but a third Xeno is going to be able to get him close. Even if he kills it, that blood splash is going to melt right through him. It's a hard call. You'd have to plug their stats into a probability algorithm. Yeah, they both fought Judge Dredd, which is pretty badass. Aliens fought Batman. So did yeah, but, but at the same time, you have to understand that, like I said, the predators they hunted the aliens. If you count AVP as as canon, uh, then they literally killed aliens by the fucking herd. Like the predators used to just kill aliens for sport. So uh, technically, the predators would win every time if you know you consider that. But um, I mean, the predators there aren't that many of them around. There aren't that many of them left. So. If the Xenomorphs keep, uh, you know, alive and they keep spreading, then technically they would probably win eventually just by sheer numbers. Let's not forget Superman and Batman versus Aliens and Predator. Who won? Can I remember? It doesn't matter. You know what? I give the overall win to Predator. It's yeah? true. Enlighten me. Predator has taken on Archie. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> that is true. Right. Archie's basically the top of the food chain. You think Predator's more of a Betty or a Veronica type of guy? Neither. Gotta go with Sabrina. <laughs> you make a good argument. I'll buy it. Predator comes out on top. See, I don't consider any of that. I don't consider any of the Batman fight with Predator and stuff. Any of that's What's not canon. Plan? Get in, get the key, free Kiki. Can we have the bunker? Can we? Can we? You have to help clean it this time. Ah, she always makes me clean. <laughs> Let's start with getting in first. Yeah, we gotta start by getting in there first. If you're, if you want to talk about who's scarier, predators are scarier for damn sure. I mean, uh, aliens are scarier for damn sure. Okay, guys, what's the plan? Well, Lanny's got that door seriously locked down. So, plan B? I got something. There's an old exhaust duct, probably overgrown. So, I'll find it. Dead. Uh, 
got a paint job thing up here. There we go. on the outside. They don't even know we're coming. I'm inside. Ooh, ooh, stinks of beer and cheesy feet. Just get that decrypt key. Fast. I shot a few shitty fuckers hanging around. Fucking dead sack micro penis fuck mullets. Did you see what they fucking did over my Rhonda's? Piss swimming shit like this late waste to the whole fucking area. Inventory fucked. Facilities fucked. Everything you can fucking think of fucking fucked. They wouldn't dare take Lenny off though. They better not. Get your hands off the my shit. Oh, hey Lenny. I'm in your house fucking up your shit. I'm in your house, fucking up your shit. She's rigged the place to blow. What? What are you looking at? Two, no, three. It looks like shit. <sighs> Maybe four. They don't seem connected, so I don't think the order matters. How many nodes? Just find another way out. Guys, guys, I need to concentrate. Okay, we got that one. that one. Just need to get this one.
Look at that. Seems like I handled the booms. This is not fucking over. Um, yeah, it is. Sweet hackerspace. It's finally rid of that prime eight smell. Is it ready? Yep. Wrench had to spray a bit of bombs be gone, and then whoosh. Go check it out. Why don't we then? There's some research available as well. Up by sniper rifles. IDs and zappers. Let me get that. Why not? Let's finish off that tree. I know I was gonna get like the last, uh, you know, battery thing, but. So yeah, here's our our new space. What it looks like now that we've gotten rid of all the primate shit. All right. So we've completed Hacker War. Let's see here. There's a new paint job as well. Oh, it's a rainbow paint job. Okay, well, let's get that. Let's see what that looks like. Oh, that's pretty cool, actually. Check that out. So, this DLC operation. Where was this operation for the 911? Oh, it's here at the hacker space. Is it? Yeah. Okay, we're just going to fast travel back there anyway. So, we'll do 911 first. And then, after we do this side op, we'll do. Uh, we'll do. A We'll start doing the DLC ones as well. Going over Bloom's crime prediction algorithm, just checking up on them after their WQZ debacle. Hmm. And this visualization shows how they flag different areas as low risk, high risk, or lethal force authorized. So these areas up in Oakland? It's high risk. That's gang territory, makes sense. Oh, but these. That, my friend, is CTOS without any makeup. Motherfucker. They're set in schools, clinics, stores that shoot on site. That's subsidized housing. I mean, th those people got priced out of San Francisco. Where the fuck else are they supposed to go? You hold on to that angle, Marcus. We're gonna need it when we go after Bloom. Oh, 
yeah, I can do that. You're right. This is systemic injustice at its highest level. You found it, Josh. Well, Ray helped me bypass the firewall. I couldn't hey, access no, this it. is all yours, kid. Good work. Hey. Inherent bias, I know. You were all pissed here. I got some of my motherfucking code in that monster. The CTOS is pushing the cops to expect a shootout. They're gonna be coming in hard, too. Basically, they'll get shot. I get it. Thanks, Mom and Dad. Let's change our clothes, shall we? We're in the miscellaneous category now. Oh, the new development, Ragnarok thing. Alright, well, let's see. Those, or those as well. Let's get something that matches this, shall we? Shoes are pretty cool to go with that. I don't really match all that much, though. Those shoes match better. No. No, I think I'm gonna go with the pizza sweater, but we're gonna do different pants. Yeah, let's do those. <laughs> I look pretty funny. That kind of matches the pizza. These match the pizza as well. I think we're gonna do those. We're gonna go with those black glasses though I'm gonna go back with them shoes let's look let's look ridiculous right I wish I had one that looked like a pizza box or something. Uh, miscellaneous bags? You know what, we'll go with that one. I look absurd. Hey, I need some info. Is it okay if I stop by? Sure, but you're gonna have to come to me. I've got an appointment I'm trying to keep. In the old neighborhood? The very same. Alright, I'll see you soon. Got my pizza shirt! Marcus, we just got a lovely phone call from Lenny. Prime 8 Lenny? Why's she calling us? It was a prank call, right? <laughs> I shit you not. She wants our help. Of course, she didn't say it that way. It was more like, Hey, douche nozzles, you wanna play with the cool kids? Meet me or get fucked by a porcupine on meth. I'm not <laughs> sure what to do with that. I guess I better check it out. Better you than me, my friend. Gee, thanks. Caustic progress. This is a DLC operation as well. 
So we are now, we're, we're actually really getting these DLC operations unlocked. <coughs> See, like, there's this one still to unlock, but we've got all the other ones unlocked still. Okay, let's see here. Miss uh, Dollar Block, meet social worker in Oakland. Investigate the police activity in Oakland. All right. So we'll drive there just because we haven't driven in a while. And we can probably Turn the Turn some music on as well. Why not? Yeah, I mean, I get the copyright claims on the videos, but it doesn't, like, make my videos ineligible from being seen. But now Twitch is trying to stop people from doing anything with fucking music on Twitch. All the DMCA bullshit. DMCA is such a stupid, the whole DMCA thing is so stupid because it's a bunch of rich people acting as if people aren't getting enough money for the shit they pay for. They act like, like, I understand that like copyright law is important to have, but the thing is, is that DMCA is treated like, as if like one person is going to ruin the entire industry. Like, oh, God forbid one person, or like, a few people, uh, have music play, you know, like, on a stream or something. Hey, are we safe to talk? We're safe as anyone else on these streets. But you probably shouldn't hang around Oakland too long. Not with your record. Do you mean the lie they have on file or what I've actually been up to? What we've got is a classic case of cops and robbers working together. The 580s oh. used to be good for this community. Now, they jump when the police say jump. Otherwise, their families get evicted. It's no way to live. But they've got no other way to live. I hear you. And I'm gonna fix it. I have to go. You be careful out there. Okay. Josh, I'm here. What should I be looking for? Just a run of the mail CTOS server. Probably tacked onto the side of the house like some kind of parasite. Charming. It's a, it's a, it's a restricted area, so I just figured I'd send a jumper in there, rather. Alright, I'm scrubbing through the data now. 
Looks like the 580 drop off a vehicle and the police come collect it. It's a different car every time. The cops are running a smuggling racket right under CTOS? Their flag is undercover, untraceable. Which means physical evidence is all we got to go by. We need that car. I'll give you an overlay of who's going to be where when. Check it out. You should be able to see the mosaic now. On it. <laughs> Looks like that's my ride. Okay, I think I got a good handle on the layout. You see anything you can use to distract them while you nab the car? I can think of a couple things, yeah. Turn ambush, steal the car. Right, I'm ready. They're inbound, so get out of sight. Good luck, kid. That's the car. Now I just gotta get it out in one piece. Guys, I'm clear, but I need a favor. I got something else to take care of up here. Find me somewhere safe I can leave this thing. I can take this bad, bad boy home. Leave it near the bridge back to Frisco. I'll swing on by ASEP. Thanks, man. All right, we got out of there fairly, uh, yeah, there fairly easily. Wrench, the car is parked and ready for pickup. Copy that, Mon Capitan. I've got my document and camera ready to go. Hello, Counselor. Marcus, to what do I owe the pleasure? We need to talk, off the record. I'll meet you down by the water sign, south of my office. I'm on my way. Okay. Alright, we're gonna go 
talk to Miranda again. Last time the corruption ran this deep, they fell under federal oversight. What is this, the fucking Riders 2.0? I thought that was supposed to fix things. What have you found? Cops shooting suspects, planting evidence, stealing and lying and cheating the system just like the old days, only now, CTOS is their alibi. Operational discretion. Look, you bring me proof, and I'll back your play. The OPD is changing, Marcus, believe me. For me and my friends, the community means everything. Bullshit. Change doesn't happen overnight. The department still has its problems, sure. It's got its reformers, too. Who are you protecting, Miranda? The community or the police? Marcus, you of all people can't be that naive. The police department and the community they protect are no longer so separate. If you want to make a change, you stop the people that are using technology as a mask. Because you and DeadSec surely aren't the only ones. And you don't start a landslide from the base of a mountain. This could get uncomfortable for your friends at OPD. My dear, if they're uncomfortable instead of being outraged, then they're friends of mine. Fair enough. Josh, the chief of the OPD is the one running this shit show. Tell me you found a way to take him down. There's a drug deal about to go down at a refinery up north. Some kind of vehicle exchange happening at the docks to the southwest. You mess up their ops, there's a chance our friendly neighborhood chief will have to come out of his hiding hole to fix it. Exactly. I'll hit the refinery first. Trafficking drugs sure would scuff the shine on his new and improved OPD facade. Oh, so there's my car. Okay, so we'll go up there. We'll hopefully, doing this, we'll shut down their operation. Keep the cops in check just a little bit more. This also might involve us getting tangled with the cops. Which may not be the greatest. Hey, I'm at the refinery. Be careful. That's Bradva territory. But still under CTOS surveillance, right? So I'm looking for another server. Let me know when you're hooked in.
I'll run the data and send you the mosaic. Not the safest parking spot for precious cargo. I spy with my little eye something beginning with EB. Want to make a bet that whatever's inside ain't waterproof? What I do not get is how they're running all this right in front of CTOS. Sure, the system's got its flaws, but this is taking being caught red-handed to a new level. They must have some kind of operation in place to scrub the footage from the servers. Given everything we found, they're not doing a very good job. Maybe the deadline hasn't rolled around yet. Like taking out the garbage. It's on a schedule. Or maybe they're getting sloppy. Believing they're above the law tends to make people arrogant. Is that a subtle jab from our resident gray hat? Just an observation, darling. You can't hack human nature. Well, not for long, anyway. Here we go. I'm about to make a lot of noise. I'll put my ear to the ground, see what comes up. Go get him. I should have just waited them for, for them to fucking park, to be honest. I don't have enough bombs for all of them. I'm about to make a lot of noise. I'll put my ear to the ground, see what comes up. Go get him.
Okay, let's get out of here. seen the smoke that came out of those things. Marcus, listen. I jacked into the OPD radio band. They are losing their shit. <laughs> Mission accomplished? What the fuck was that? I don't know. Everything just went haywire. The shipment's totaled. I'll cover for you this time, but if it happens again, our careers are over. Do you understand? Well, there you go. Sounds like you really stirred things up. <laughs> that was a plan, right? You'd better get a move on over to the docks. We want to maintain the element of surprise. Oh, there's still more to this? Jesus. Like, how much more is there, like, with this shit? The last thing I want is to, like, have to deal with actual fucking cops. It's like some of these side ops are, like, a couple missions. Then you have ops like this that are like 10 missions and they're not even that fun. Like this is a, like this is a boring side op to be honest. Like, this whole thing like oh yeah, do the cops and stuff. Uh, who cares? Like but the reason I'm doing it is because it's part of the story and because we get followers for doing it. But it's just fucking boring. Especially when it's like, oh, plot out, plan out this thing. Josh, I'm at the dock. Look out for Tescas. Shit, this is their territory? Yes. Alright, I'm gonna find a server. Maybe it won't be that bad. Process now. Anything interesting? The Tescas always drive an ambulance. The police always take away a body bag. What? Statistically, if you want to transport someone, an ambulance is the safest way to do so. Somehow I don't think they're concerned about the patient's safety. That's my ticket out of here. Just need to make sure I don't destroy myself or the evidence in the process. You really think this is gonna work? The Chief has a reputation. His temper's gonna get the best of him, I guarantee it. He should never have been sworn in. We don't always get to choose the people who protect us. Maybe it's time that changed. about to steal an ambulance from a bunch of corrupt cops and possibly get shot to death. You get to have all the fun. And showtime.
let's escape out this way. And no one will find us. There we go. Shit, I can't believe I just stole a corpse. You're gonna wanna drop it like it's hot, son. Right in front of the FBI headquarters ought to do it. You already hit the angry corrupt cop mother load. Listen to this. Osprey, report. I don't know what happened, sir. It's like they they knew we were coming. You're relieved of your duties. But, sir. Tell Kestrel to be on the next boat. He won't want to be late. No, sir. Cooper out. Okay, so now let's go drop this body off. In front of the FBI, I guess. Predicted shoot on site is on Alcatraz. I Seriously, another Ooh. one. <laughs> but what's the worst that could happen, right? Don't say that. Seriously, it's her Macbeth. Yeah, I'll keep that in mind when I'm being murdered on the abandoned prison island. I'm out. So now we have to go to fucking Alcatraz. Yeah, see this this side up is like super boring. It's not fun at all. It's just like, hey, set up a bunch of traps to kill people and <clears throat> yada yada. It's just like I don't really give a shit to be honest. Like we're getting followers, sure, but Oh man, I'm going to the rock. I never got to go as a kid, you know. That's crazy. You love Alcatraz. <laughs> Only as much as the next guy. Quick, what was the date of the mess hall riot? Which one? Nerd. <laughs> oh, hey, I... Nerd. All right, talk to this guy. Can you tell me a little about the island? Well, of course, young man. What would you like to know? Is this place covered by CTOS? It was installed very recently, but yes. Are you sure you don't want to know about the history of this amazing cultural landmark instead? I've got the pocket guide, thanks. A canned experience is no substitute for the real thing, you know. Yeah, you're right about that. What the hell? I should do it. There's more footage than I thought there would be. This is going to take a while. Yeah, so they're throwing a body wait. in the river. I got one hell of a view. Oh, shit. There's footage of the cops murdering people on the rock five, six times already. Then I need to get out of here without alerting the murder patrol. No time. Camera 11. They're here? Shit. And that's gotta be Kestrel. Get out of there, Marcus. Nah, we need him. Alive. He can verify the list of names we pulled. The cops are already inside. There's no planning yourself out of this one. Freestyle it is. Free the witness.
Sir, you need to get the hell out of here. I just killed a fucking boatload of police. Keep going. See, this is what the sh kind of shit you gotta deal with. We're gonna fucking lose these cops. so that nobody finds us. Just long enough, eh? Woo! Hello? Is this thing working? I hear you. You okay? Yes. I am somewhere safe. Your friends gave me temporary access to this channel so I could thank you. You can thank me by going public. Count on it, my friend. Take it easy out there. Well. We're able to end that pretty easily, I guess. No, we just killed a shitload of cops. Now, please tell me that's the fucking last mission of that piece of shit. Yo, I am never going to Alcatraz again. You got to live the dream, man! You escaping the rock? That is 100% legit. Okay, they, they, do, do you mind, man? I, look, look, I, I think I just want to sleep for like a year if that's okay with you guys. All Not right? yet. Yo, come on, come on. All right, fine, fine, I'm up. Damn. And, voila. Here with us now is City Councilor Miranda Kamei with her take on this latest blow to Oakland's foundering reputation. 
Thank you, Shirley. But if it were not for the actions of public watchdogs and one very forthcoming eyewitness, we would not be having this conversation. It is my pleasure to announce that we have already launched a full-scale internal investigation with the cooperation of Oakland's finest. We want to make the Oakland PD a, a welcome. <laughs> Citizens of the digital age, welcome. Elements of the Oakland Police Department thought they could use predictive analytics to make Oakland safer. Instead, those who are corrupt hid in plain sight by perverting a feature designed to protect honest police officers from detection and retaliation. They smuggled drugs and organized hits, and they killed those who opposed them over and over and over. An official inquest into the OPD is underway, but the real culprit, Bloom's crime prediction algorithm, remains free of blame. Perhaps it is free of systemic bias, as its creators claim. Or perhaps it was able to be perverted because those filters, to single out the weak, the poor, the powerless, were already hard-coded. Without a release of their source code, we will never know for sure. DeadSec is giving you the truth. Do what you will. Look, look. Bigger picture moment here. Okay? Let's all breathe in. Everything Dead Set does supports our narrative. And breathe out. Dead Sec is a distraction, but they are our distraction. So let's hold on to that thought. Namaste. Kind of unusual to get a video and a cutscene from a side up. Alright, so we have that done. We have some research here. I think we will go ahead and get the, the botnet upgrade so that we have if the full one of those. And I think what we'll do is um let's see here. Uh, nah, I'm still going to hold off, I think. Alright, so, when we look at these, we have uh, Automata, Noodle's keynote. Noodle's making a big announcement, and Wrench thinks you'll be very interested in what they have to say. Caustic progress. Meet Lenny in the uh, Wilds Club. Dead Seconds learn the mysterious deaths among the homeless, possibly caused by illegal experiments. Then we have Moscow Gambit. Uh, Alejandro Jack, uh, Jakovsky uh, has made a mockery of the dead sick name in his latest porn movie, which is flattering, but he but he also happens to be an abusive asshole. We're going to teach him a lesson. I think we'll do that one. Anyone who wants to make a mockery of us, well, let's get on their ass about it, right? Oh, we got the Capone stuff as well. Pinstripe suit, pinstripe pants, pinstripe hat. Although I typically don't want to wear the hat, I wear like match with the pinstripes, so I think we'll go with that one. Oh, and let's change the shoes. 
This one's going to sting Bloom hard. Evidence of all hard facts, too. They can't pretty up this one. Are you sure you want to hand it all over to Miranda? Proper channels take a lot longer. Well, the longer it takes, the more it's in the public eye. Yeah, you're right. Actually, you know what? I'm not really feeling this beanie with this. Is that what I went to? No. No? For the love of God. I like this. I had to go with it. classier okay so where is this at oh so this is right down the street okay There's a, uh, there's a, um, There's a uh, trophy for traveling 200 meters on top of a car. There it is. <laughs> I need to get up. What is this? Come on. No, no my way. Go get some botnet upgrades. I was just gonna get something quick and cheap, a uh, tribal band or something. There we go. this car here drive the little bit of the rest of the way around the block so now I've never done this so this is going to be I mean I have done that lat that 911 that we did I did do that but I just don't remember much about it because it's boring all right so we'll do Fill our ammo. Ain't that a shame? And we'll talk to Stara. What the? So yeah, I've never done this uh, DLC up before, so this is gonna be brand new. Yo, you got a dog? Nope. Say to penetrate my ports, citizens <laughs> of the world. Are you ready for that sex? Ugh. Yo, I didn't think this was your style. Relax, he's cool. The point is, it's a branding problem. And if somebody wants to fuck us over, I'd rather they do it to my face. 
The director's a real art house shit stain and stalker extraordinaire. We humiliate him on camera, get more followers. I don't like it right. that much. He hurt one of my friends in the industry, turned her into an addict. So I trashed his accounts. One thing led to another. And oh, Rachel and I firebombed his 1972 Cadillac. <laughs> God, that thing burned beautifully. Or one for Sitar. It's a big ass paddle. He's filming down the street at BDS Mania. Make it spectacular, Marcus. And hey, wait, this is a pawn shop for porn stars? <laughs> All right. Hack into Halahantro's office. So what happened to your friend? Did you get her help? Stayed up long nights with her. Got her clean. It was hell, but we got through it. The problem is, someone who's been through that once, all it takes is a bad mood swing, and they've fallen off the wagon again. So she hasn't recovered? Most of the time. She's making progress, but he really fucked her up. I do think humiliating this asshole is going to help with the healing. Consider it done. Five points, but I don't think that I can get anything for five. No. Okay, so for us to get in there. To unlock this. Like the crew's having some kind of rooftop party. Maybe your guy's out here somewhere. He won't be. Unless it's on set, he avoids social interaction like the plague. If they're yeah, shooting anything right inside, here. that's where you'll find him. Total control freak. Okay, here we are. Okay. So now we can hack it here. See the magic being made. Oh boy! All right. Well, let's prepare ourselves for whatever we're about to, f to fucking see. So I need to find dirt on what's his name? Alejandro Jakovsky. <laughs> right. And then spank him, literally, and film it. I need it for my video. You sure you don't want to be the one doing this? She would smash his skull into tiny pieces, which doesn't work as well for our image, as fun as it sounds. He's not exaggerating. Right, so that means I need to try to isolate him. If he's busy filming, I'm gonna have to do a little social engineering. I got a plan. Let's hear it. It involves a little disguise work, a little gumption, and a whole lot of fluffing. Man, fuck you. Hey, when you're faced with a shaky ladder, you need to get a firm grip on the rungs. Son, no, Rachel, just no. 
Let's go, sex bot. Show oh, my God. Oh, my God. Spread out. What moves it makes noise. Oh, Jesus. But we can't do this. You're my stepmother. Oh, my God. Mm, I like your process. So I need the access key. I see a lot of non-fucking going on where there should be fucking. Do I need to show you how it's done? Because I will. What the fuck? There's some Satan ass shit going on here. to this. get into this camera All right, everybody in position. Let's do this. and get into his phone your assistant's leaking shit to dead sec we go down you go six feet down double the fee and maybe we help you solve this oh Jesus Christ evidence I guess. Sitara, my alien sex tentacle robot got me into BDSM's bookkeeping. A huge chunk of profit money was deposited recently. He's been playing dirty. I passed it along to one of our dummy accounts. You can pick the charity and redistribute. That's so sweet. I know just the one. Also, alien sex tentacle robot. I've named him Pokey. <laughs> of course he did. What's next? Well, now that the money's gone, I'll use it to scare so Mr. Jackowski off the set. Kind of a free ticket to Spank City. That's an excellent prototype. Let's crowdfund it. Consider it backed. What are the tier rewards? Hey, one thing at a time, people. 
There we go. El Director! It's time for your close-up. Who the fuck are you? Oh shit, you're dead sick. Yep. Hey, you know, I heard you really like it rough, right? So, I was wondering if you could take it as much as you can dish it. Oh, it's time to join DedSec. It's your initiation. So I'm thinking he should join us. So listen, Director. I'm in charge of this film. And here, I would uh. say I love DedSec every time you feel a little <clears throat> back there, okay? So what are you going to say? Let's just go straight into shooting. No rehearsal. I, I love that sick. No, you're lying. You're off book already. Uh, oh, oh, shit. <laughs> you are really good. You're a hell of an actor. Have you been on the other side of the camera? Yeah, I am making pay. Yeah, yeah, and this is great. Well, there we go. <laughs> Did y'all see that? Felt it too. Youch! We've been looking through Jakovsky's files. He has some very questionable business partners. It'll take a while to get through them all. In the meantime, our video is almost ready. Just waiting on you to come home. Hey, I have a question. Do you think he became a pornography director because his last name was Jakovsky? Or is it just a coincidence? Ha! <laughs> Hun, it's an alias he uses to sell his brand. His real last name is Spagitsky. <laughs> Funny. Hey, you there, Dale. Oh. All right, so I have six research points now. I can actually get something else. Um, just rid of fire. Let's see here. This is a cooldown. Yeah, let's say let's reduce the cooldown on those. So we get them faster. And yeah, let's just we'll just drive back to the hacker space. So we can watch the video we're putting out. Witness to what? Oh dear. There's a lot of crazy shit beneath the surface. You know that, or you wouldn't be here, right? You could say that. Well, having you here, getting followers to download our app, going public with all this, it'll be good to start seeing what the hell's going on. Uh, I think he's gonna need one of those inflatable donut things, you know, 
Can't put too much pressure on the chief when you sit down for the deuce. All right, people, <laughs> drop what you're doing and gather round. Big fast. Cheers, guys. Alright, here's the video. Citizens of the digital age, welcome, welcome. This is a message to all who would oppose dead sacks. You target one of us, you target us all. Let's see what acclaimed porn director and human shit stain Alejandro Dukovsky has to say about his recent attempt to harass one of our members. Alejandro here is getting a taste of what he puts his own actors through. When you're as much of a sadist dickwad as he is, it's important to be able to take as much as you hand out. Our message is simple. Don't fuck with dead sick. We give you the truth. Do what you will. Hey, buddy. You got a light? Yeah, sorry, brother. Oh, shit. You got him. Bring the van. Hey, where's my ten bucks? Uh-oh. I think it was a little more than we bargained for. I, you know, I was just thinking, like, oh, that's a pretty short, uh, that's a pretty short DLC thing. Uh, well, I don't think we're done yet. I think we're, we just scratched the surface. Oh shit, they put me in a fucking car crusher, man. <clears throat> Guys, the Bratva grabbed me. Try to take me out with a car crusher too. What the fuck? I told you guys something was wrong. This could be payback for BDS mania. Why would the Bratva care? We'll keep looking through Alejandro's files. It's gotta be in there somewhere. Oh, and Wrench punched a hole in the wall. Yeah, yeah, not my finest moment. Ain't nobody's ever punched a hole in the wall for me before. Thanks, Wrench. Yeah, don't mention it. guys over here.
station. Jesus, I'm not going to be able to get anything. So I have fucking cops all over the fucking place now. fucking die because Here's my gear. Suspect is in sight. We see him. Give yourself up! All units, this is squad. Air support is approved and inbound. Squad, this is PH2. We found suspect in our tracking. I think I'm clear now. Find anything? Yes. Alejandro Tchaikovsky. Bigger creep than we thought. It turns out Tchaikovsky uses illegal Russian immigrants in some of his films. Trading passports for performances. It's all documented. And of course the damn Bradfa made all that happen. Look, well I think that gives us more than enough reason to hit him back. Duh. I'm coming to see you so we can figure this thing out. Okay. Oh man, fucking, I wanted to... Get that spray can. That's one way to do it. No, 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 that is the only way to do it. All right, fast, mean. This one's mine, Marcus. Marcus, don't you fucking sideline me on this one, bud. Okay, this one's mine. All right, all right, fine. We do it wrench style. What do you mean? Right. Okay, well, Satara linked a bunch of house sales for one guy. Back by what? So you, you literally want to burn that shit to the ground? Wrench style, baby. Okay, all right, hey, let's do it, yeah. All right.
Okay, so now that we've done that, our next mission is to meet with Wrench, of course. Bravo's Woods warn us, attack our members, reputation on multiple fronts. Alright, so I think that's what we're going to do next time. We're going to continue with that, and then I think that we'll do uh, more of the DLC ops. We'll do either Automata or Caustic Progress. Um, because our main operation, which is watched, um, we will, well, the main op is just going to continue the story forward, so we're going to do, you know, all of our side stuff, of course. So, next time, uh, when we come back, we will do, we'll continue with Moscow Gambit, and, uh, we'll go to war with the Brothba. So, thank you all for joining me, and I will see you all in the next one. Take care, and goodbye.